Hello and welcome back to FMP Toots. In this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to add a transition in Final Cut Pro. It's relatively simple. Uh, there's a keyboard shortcut and there's a way to do it uh, just regular clicking. I'm going to show you the clicking version first. So if you go over here you'll see that you have an array of icons. This one right here is for transitions. Once you hover over it it'll say show or hide the transitions browser. Let's click that. Now you're presented with a variety of transitions. You can type in here the type of transition you would like. For example, cross dissolve. And you get it right there. Now, once you find it, you can just um, drag and drop into your video. Or you could uh, go through it slowly and it'll show you how the transition will pan out. So what you do is you can click and drop. Uh, sometimes it'll say that you're going to have to overlap it. If that's not a problem, go ahead and hit Create Transition. There it is. If you select here, press play, you will see your video transition into your next video. Right, just like that. To change the duration of your uh, clip, you can uh, select it right click it and click change duration then simply go ahead and type in a number so say you want it to go for 230 230 uh, frames and then hit enter press the space bar and you will see that it lasts for a little bit longer and that's how you do it if you have any questions or comments let me know in the area below i'd be happy to answer them thank you Thanks for checking out another one of my videos here at FMP Toots. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and you found it very useful. Uh, the main mission here at FMP Toots is to sh simply share the knowledge of uh, Revit, SketchUp, iMovie, and other software out there that uh, people might just have simple questions with or have, you know, a bit more complicated of a question. Uh, I really try to target as big of an audience as possible. Um, if you find that the tutorials are helpful to you and you think that they might, you know, you might have a colleague who is struggling, feel free to pass on the link. All you have to do is go to the top of the page, uh, press Control C on your Windows or Command C on your Mac, and then paste that link in an email, uh, on a Facebook message, even through YouTube. It's pretty simple. Um, if you'd like to continue seeing my videos, um, go ahead and like or subscribe to the page. This way you can get reoccurring updates saying that I updated or I uploaded another video. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, uh, hit me in the discussion area or email me at slkr2016 at gmail.com. Uh, have yourself a great day. Thank you.